ends. Um, look at me. I decided to dress in my Jamaican outfit. That actually, that outfit so that you can visualize me. This I wore to the Blue Mountain. I actually didn't even wear it again. I wore it once and never again because it's winter now. Anyway, I'm going to tell you about episode four, part three, the Blue Mountain. Oh, what drama, drama, drama. Now, remember the night before we had the pool party? And it was crazy and people were talking trend language. I didn't understand trend language. And it was just chaos. And then we all went to bed with that tension, you know, the Satan tension and all of that. And it was just like, like you know, it wasn't the vibe, the mood wasn't nice. It was very somber. And then remember the next morning we went um, for a long, long drive in the quantum. Do you remember? So now we have to drive to the Blue Mountain and the mood is like, oh, it's a little bit of tension, you know. So they split us up, four girls and three girls in the two quantums. And we were in our quantum and we drove. It was a long, long, long drive, probably two hours. I can't remember, maybe, maybe longer. And we drove this long, winding, long, narrow road. It was beautiful. All I could think was, good Lord, I wish I could run a marathon here. It would be an awesome down run, you know. I'd, I'd definitely get a PB there, um, personal best for those of you that don't understand running language. Um, so yes, it was very beautiful. It was magical, beautiful. It was very, very, very beautiful going to the Blue Mountain. Anyway, now we just arrived at the Blue Mountain. We got out of the quantum, dancing and and now we are dancing and we are singing with the locals. You know, for those of you who watched the episode, would have seen that. And it was really nice. The Rasta was, it's a, in uh, the Blue Mountain is a huge Rasta community. Loads and loads of like a Rasta families and, you know, kiddies and moms and dads. It was very pretty. And the family who owns the restaurants on the top of the hill, they've owned it for generations and generations, like hundreds of years, 200 years or something. Um, so we got to meet the family. It was lovely and they cooked a meal for us. Anyway, we sat down and everybody's a little bit like, you know, tense. You know, me, I'm a jolly good old self, always talking, laughing, making fun of everybody else. And um, we sat down. And for those of you that can remember, I said, please, ladies, can we just not have any drama today? Can we just... Anyway, we sat down and two minutes later, after just being all happy and making a toast and um, two minutes later, a huge, I don't know, the trend language started and the insults started and we were all like talking to one another and it was just a huge mess. It was the bomb just dropped and it went from bad to worse, insult after insult. Everybody saying, one person saying something, the other person retaliating and the next person. It was just, it was, it was just a shock, you know, to me too. And like literally here, I came here in my bright yellow clothes, wanted to have a lovely time, experience the Blue Mountain, maybe go for a walk, go for a hike, go for a little stroll down at the bottom, take some photographs. It was just a shit show. It was terrible, terrible. Anyway, it was a mess. It was, it went from like, you know, nice and calm to just like, boom, it's just an explosion. From out of nowhere, I suppose the tension was brewing and brewing for a couple of days and it just like a bomb just exploded. Anyway, you know, one of the cast members walked off, said she went outside and she was doing her thing outside and we were still so angry. I suppose that's going to be in the next episode, so I don't want to talk much about it. But in case it's not in the next episode, now you can all imagine with all this mess that happened at the Blue Mountain, we now had to go home, back to the villa, still again in two separate cars, in two separate quantums, we had to go back to the villa. And we went back to the villa, all eight of us in two separate cars, quantums. Now you can imagine, we eight ladies or seven ladies are all staying in the same villa with the same house manager. We have to have dinner together and we got to wake up tomorrow morning. We got to have breakfast together. Can you imagine the tension that was there in that house that night after the Blue Mountain? 
it was terrible. It was terrible, terrible. Just being there, the, it was it was just not nice. And I don't like drama, especially when I'm vacation. I'm just a jolly good person. I just love life and I love people. And I just like see the goodness in them. Even if people's ugly, I'm still like, you know, there's some goodness in you, you know. But it was, in, can you imagine what it was like? In so anyway, what I want to say, I don't, I don't think I can tell you um, much that happened after the episode for because maybe they're going to do a continuation of the blue mountain next week so i can't really say much that happened but i don't think there was much that happened because i think we kind of all left after that um and obviously production when we got back to the villa all the ladies from the blue mountain they weren't filming us at all so, oh so this is basically what i want to say so when we arrived at the villa there was no production there was no cameras it was just us so you can imagine the, ten the tension that was in the house and there was no cameras around. Um, it wasn't nice. It really wasn't nice at all. So um, I'm telling you, it was awful. The tension was terrible, but you will never get to see it because production kind of what I'm upset about, you know, I'm very athletic, I'm very sporty. So I'm, I'm like, like, gosh, man, I'm so pissed off because we drove two hours to get there. It was, you don't understand, it was beautiful, it was beautiful. But all we did, I got out of the quantum, sat at the table, fought at the table, back in the quantum, back home. I didn't get to go on a walk, I didn't get to go on a hike, I didn't get to go and run, I didn't get to taste coffee or see some coffee factory. I didn't get to see anything. I didn't get to experience the Blue Mountain. I didn't talk to the locals. Um, so I'm upset because I am very sporty. I love doing sporty things. And I didn't even go down into the valleys just to go and have a look because we got from the quantum, sat at the table, from the table, into the quantum, home. So anyway. Hey loves, I hope all is well. Liz from The Real Housewives of Trebecha and The Ultimate Girls Trip South Africa spilled the tea on her experience during episode four. And it's juicier than a mango in the Jamaican sun. According to Liz, the ladies were at each other's throats like cats in a bag and the reason, trend language. For those who are living under a rock, trend language is basically TikTok language. And guess who loves it? Mel. She's been throwing around trendy words like a confetti at a wedding and it's driving the other ladies up the wall liz spilled the tea that mel would call the other ladies names and then blame it on trend language talk about a convenient excuse but let's be real if i called my boss a simp and blamed it on tiktok i'd probably be out of a job faster than you can say can cancel culture the drama was so intense that Liz didn't even get to explore the Blue Mountains properly. Can you imagine missing out on a stunning views and fresh mountain air just because your friends can't handle a little TikTok lingo? Girl, bye. And speaking of Twitter, fans are going wild. At Gossip Girl 2024 tweeted, I'm living for the drama. Mel better watch her back because the ladies are not here to play. At the Real Housewives fan added, I can't believe they missed out on the Blue Mountains because of some silly trend language priorities people. So what do you think? Is Mel an, the ultimate trendsetter or just a TikTok dictionary? Let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, hit the notification bell for new videos. Until then, take care. Have a fantastic day. Bye.